Hey guys, welcome back. Today we are going to be playing a destruction mission from my World War II war game. So we have my brother here who is playing with us. And we have me, the Archmage himself. Okay, so in today's game we are playing Nazis versus the U.S., for Lucas's army list, he has an M1 male tank, a lieutenant, three shotgunners, and a grenadier. For my setup, I have a panzer, two grenadiers, two shotgunners, and a commander. So, without any further ado, let's get started. Okay, so first we are going to roll off. Highest number goes first. Five. Two. So Lucas gets to go first. For his movement, his M1 male tank is going to get six inches of movement. His lieutenant is going to get seven, and the rest of his troops is going to get six. So we'll see you guys when all those troops are moved up. Okay, so now his guys are moved up. Now he gets to move on. To his miscellaneous phase, I believe. Ooh, miscellaneous phase. Yes. Oh. Holy crap. This document won't load. Yeah, we're having a little bit of a hard time getting the rules. Okay, so now into the shoot phase. Okay, now I've moved my guys up. Now it is on to the shooting phase. So I am in range to shoot, but I have to use the templates since it is a destruction mission. So my grenadier that is on top of the building is going to throw a grenade. Now it says on the dash sheet, only one model can do this per turn. So, I can throw it up to 8 inches. And, yeah, that would work. And it has a 1-inch blast radius. And so it goes here. As you can see, at least two models are affected by it. So, two shotgunners. We are going to roll two dice. And I'm going to hit on threes. Ooh, that's going to hurt. Yep, that is going to hurt. Now, according to the data sheet, TS of 3 against armor of 4. Which means I'm going to need 1s, and I pretty much already get that. Now, Lucas needs to make a save. My Grenadier's PIS is 2. You only need 2. Why do you have 3 in your hand? <laughs> Sorry. PIS of 2 against save of 3. So you are going to need 5 to save. I Looks like he one. only makes 1. So one guy is not affected. However, the one guy that is affected, which is that one shotgun over here, is taking D3 plus 2. That's 2. Plus two is going to be four, which exceeds the limit of two for the hit points. So he is gone. Now, time for my shotgunner. As you can see, he does not affect any models. Now, on to the commander. He has the rapid fire straight template, and he is looking at the lieutenant. So, I am attacking the lieutenant. So now, half-range attacks is going to be two, so we are going to roll two dice. So you can, as you can see, only one hits. Then, PS of two against armor, four twos. Lucas, you are going to need to roll one die. 
and that does not succeed. Okay, so how much damage does he take? He is taking d6 plus 2. So 3 damage. 3 damage. Now your lieutenant has 5 hit points, so he is down to 2. Yeah, what is the lowest you can roll? Now it is my panzer's attack. He needs to measure. So the range is 15 inch. And my panzer is back here. That is going to instantly hit that one grenadier there. So it is three ups to hit. And it's A is one, so he makes one attack with it. PS of three against armor of four. That is ones that hits. Or wounds, sorry. Now you're going to need to roll a save. It's PIS is one, so you're going to need a fours. And he I gets a one. So is he dead? He takes D6 plus three. He's dead. And any malls within two inches of that unit, so pretty much those two models there, take a D2 damage. So, Grenadier is dead. Now the other two take D2. Your lieutenant takes two. He's dead. He's dead also. And that other shotgunner is dead. So that is three models dead within my turn. So this is looking pretty... With Lucas's troops moved up, now it's on to the shooting phase. Now, Lucas is going to go with his tank first, which has an SS, or shooting skill, of three ups. Now, he... His guns are at half-range attacks of two... And he's within half range. So cool. But just to make sure, you're going to use the template. And as you can see, he hits both of those guys. The shotgunner so, and the grenadier. So it's four dice or two dice? Two dice. Okay, so hold on. Okay, so got my two dice. Now, you're going to roll them and try to get threes. Both hit. Both hit. Okay. Now, your PS is three against my armor four, so you're going to need ones. Instantly get that. Your PIS is one against my save of three, so I'm going to need fours. Yep, I get that. Oh, you're lucky. And so, it is now your shotgunner's turn. Now, he is looking upwards, so you can hit the Grenadier and my commander. I'm gonna shoot the commander. Okay, well, then you're gonna roll two dice. Now, just to let you guys know, if it's half-range attacks, you already are rolling two dice. And if it's two models, doesn't affect the amount. Okay. So, let me guess, I'm needing threes again. Uh, Yes. So you so, get both of those. Now your P I no your P S sorry is two against my armor of four. So you're gonna need twos. Twos. I get one. You get one of them. Okay. Well now is P I S of one against save of three. So it's gonna be four save. And I instantly make that. Are you serious? So now. It is my turn. I am using my little grenadiers. Oh, I can't. Killed them using my shotgunner, and I am taking out your other shotgunner. Maybe. Probably. I hit. Damn. PS of two against armor of four. That is going to be Twos. Are Holy crap. Are you serious? Now, Lucas, my PIS is one. Your save is threes. Get fours up. Four and up? Yep. For one. 
Yep, yeah, one. Three. Nice. Okay, well, that model is going to take d6 damage. Or, let's get a little bit of a rain check on that. No, that is d8, so d6 plus 2. That's 5 divided by 2, rounded down. Wait, no. Right, sorry. Okay, then that's 5 damage. He did. Yep, he did. He out of there. Okay, now it is time for my characters to move. Uh, wait, no, wow. Wait, did you not do your move? I did not do my move, I don't think. No, you didn't. You just went right into shooting. Well, then I guess that is Luke's turn. Okay. So now he's already within half range. So, I'm just going to shoot. Okay, then you're going to need the rapid fire cone template. Here you go. So, that would be he hits both. So, I need two dice. Yep. Get them both. Get them both, I think. Five and a six. Okay, then you get them both. So, I'm going to need to roll two dice. It's PIS is one against my save of three, so I'm going to need fours. And I save both of those. You How? cannot do anything. How? Now, it is my turn to turn all my guys towards your tank. Now, you're going to wipe the floor with me. The commander can hit your tank. Wipe me with the floor. And he is within half range. Wipe. I only get one. PS is two against armor of five. So I am going to need to get threes. Now, Lucas, is your save. E Lucas, your save. Oh, sorry. PIS of one. Okay, he saves. So then, I guess it is now my Grenadier's turn. Uh-oh. He is going to throw a grenade. But this looks like it's going to be the end of me. <laughs> Unfortunately, he does not make that. He never even measured to make sure. Dude, you, I can throw it up to eight inches. Measure. Stopping be, an ass. Be good for the audience. Holy Need crap, shut up. Don't well. Half range attacks. Only one makes it through. Lucas, you're safe. So, it is going to be you instantly fail. I'm dead, yeah, aren't I? No, your M1 male has 8 hit points. D6 plus 2 damage. It's dead. Y okay. It's a D6. Well, that was the game, so Nazis win. I didn't even take any casualties. And everybody hates the well, Nazis. That that was so our first battle report. Keep casting spells and keep painting minis. We'll see you in the next one.